Today, I fly a plane. Yeah, you heard me right. And no, I don't have a pilot's license. Wish us luck. So how did I find myself flying a plane thousands of feet in the air with virtually no training? This is Hanson, and thankfully for my two friends in the back and as well as myself, he's a real pilot. This man does the coolest stuff. He surfs, bikes, cooks amazing food, and is even a snowboard instructor. Oh yeah, and he flies planes. So shortly after meeting Hanson through a close friend of mine, I just had to make plans to fly with him one day. So I did a bit of studying and a ground course with Hanson to learn the basics, and apparently that's enough to take full control of an airplane. Yeah. I wouldn't trust me flying one either, but luckily I found two friends with death wishes. <laughs> so on the day of the flight, we met up at the airport to fly. Thank you so much. Alright, this man's our pilot for the day. Look at that, it's taking off like right there. Oh, look at that, private jet probably. Hell yeah, dude, you can watch planes coming in here. I don't know why I'm so fascinated by this. Alright, I am ready. So, do we have a parachute? You have hands on. <laughs> So, no. We don't have laboratory, so you guys yeah, are all set. Yeah. Rock and roll. Let's do it. Let's go. You don't need a passport, no nope. check bag, no security. Just two doors and you're there. <laughs> we already introduced Hansen. You know his deal. He's the pilot. Our lives are in his hands and mine too. So, you know. <laughs> Our boy over here, we got Jared. Just a homie. <laughs> Just a homie. And of course, as yeah. always, our boy In the light. <laughs> all right, so yeah, we're gonna go fly this plane. I have no idea what's gonna happen. This is all our first time doing this. Hanson's the only one that knows what he's doing. Yeah, there's actually a chance they won't let us into the Boston, I guess, airspace because we're just not, I guess, they, they just might not authorize us. Yeah, we're, we're, we're not part of the club. <laughs> Dude, look, I can touch the plane. <laughs> Dude, it's crazy. <laughs> Alright, this is Tencent. I've been flying since 2019, um, student pilot training. Got my license 2020, um, October. Aviation is always my dream. And I've been flying for four years, 30 plus time around Boston. Welcome on board, gentlemen. Pretty much like a takeoff and landed 400 times at this airport and the Bedford, which is like 20 nautic miles away. Okay. 400 takeoff, 400 landing. Okay, okay. <laughs> like today is your show time. Sweet. <laughs> So we got this 360 camera down here guys to get an amazing view of the whole flight. You guys will see later on throughout the flight. But that's it for now. Alright, our boy Jared's in. First class! How's first class my boy? <laughs> the bridge. Yeah. Put your feet on those like black pedals. Yep. You good? Yeah. Okay, those are our brick and also our left and right. So we're on okay. the ground. On the ground. Got it. Oh! <laughs> Yo! Yes, I feel it moving. Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I think I understand. So if you couldn't tell by my glistening cheeks and facial reactions, I was pretty nervous. I wasn't sure what Hanson was going to let me do, and well, first he let me control the plane on the ground, and then he actually let me take the plane off. feeling was unreal. After flying for about 10 minutes, we started to enter the Boston airspace, where my co-pilot, Hanson, <laughs> requested access into the Class Bravo airspace. Luckily, they granted us the request and actually required that we stay under 1,500 feet to not interfere with, well, 
also Logan Airport. This was perfect for us, as you'll see in a short bit. Dude! Holy sh**! Now, I've flown drones for hundreds, maybe thousands of hours now, but let me tell you, nothing could compare to this feeling. A 360 degree view of flying not over, but through the city of Boston. Hi Radic, what's your opinion on Richard's flying today? It, I mean, it's pretty good. It is, it's pretty good. He's an expert, man. I, I, you know, he even shook the plane around and we didn't die, so I trust him now. <laughs> so after flying through the city, Hanson decided to surprise me with an engine failure drill. Now, if you ask me what the scariest thing about being in a plane is, it's the engine failing, and the thought of coming crashing down into the earth. But turns out, even when the engine is completely powered off, airplanes glide. For miles even. You do lose altitude, but not as fast as I thought you would. Anyway, after scaring me half to death, Hanson decided to take it one step further with some stalling and crazy maneuvers. Sun finally setting, we finally return to the airport for landing. Expect us to stall like that. Just going off the plane. I literally flew a plane. <laughs> How did I do? Break out. Let's Break go! Out. I can't believe I could do all that without a pilot's license. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Wow, he's just pushing a plane by himself. He works out, by the way, if you couldn't tell. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Hanson, thank you so much, man. That was an amazing flight. I've never ever flown a plane before. <laughs> he let me take way more control than I thought I would was gonna have. <laughs> hey, it's, I was actually a lot of fun, and it's like doable. Like, if someone told me I had to land a plane, I feel like I could do it. Like, if I had to. Right, and you, you're in charge of an emergency landing. Yeah, it, at the, at it, felt, the it felt okay. Did you land yeah, he, I pulled the power all the way off and yeah. simulated engine failure. We dropped from 2,500 feet. In all my the way head, down to 800. We, we had no engine for like five minutes. In my oh. head, when the engine fails, yeah. you're going down. Oh, you glide. But you glide, yeah. 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 Like for a while too. And yeah, so like we were like making that spin and turn to like land in that field if we needed to. I've, like I feel like it would have been possible. The it's first like, maneuver is literally yeah. simulated engine fair. Yeah. 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 You guys didn't even notice, right? We just gradually descended. Oh, no, I noticed. We saw we oh. were getting really low. <laughs> 
Well, I knew, I knew we were fine because I know planes are designed to glide without the engine. Yeah. 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 And, the, and, the, and the weight in the front oh, of the engine keeps it. Let's yeah. play something else. Yeah. We have a one million likes. Let's do it. <laughs> yes, sir. Hit that like and subscribe. But yeah, wrapping it up, y'all. A uh, huge shout out and thanks to our boy Hanson over here. He has a website actually where he actually does these tours for people. So go check that out if you're around Boston and want to do it. It was a lot of fun. And you can even do those, woo, the stall maneuvers and everything. It's a lot of fun. And also shout out to uh, Boston ATC for letting us fly in that close. Fenway Park, the bridge, Zakem Bridge, everything. That was a lot of fun. Our boy Jared and Radic in the back there got a whole bunch of shots for us. Oh yeah. Appreciate it. Oh my god, this was quite an experience. The next video I actually have planned is also gonna include the airplane, but in a different way. So stay tuned for that. That's about it. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. But yeah, I've been broke but rich. Stay happy and healthy. <laughs> we, go we, have to, we should fly out and another exit air, you know. <laughs> So we're stuck now. What? Uh, oh, you gotta hold it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>